So we do a, a range of boilers. We do valence, remeyers, and also faxes and glow worms. The newer ones, which are the valence, they have a fault code of F numbers. Normally F28 on the valence. And on the older boiler, like the remeyers, it's normally E4. That means then that there's no gas coming to the boiler. It could be a problem in the boiler, on a gas valve in the boiler. It's just due to your meter having no gas on. Therefore, just check the meter by pushing the button, make sure you've got gas on. If it says it's on, then obviously it's a fault on the boiler. If it says it's off and top up, then you need to obviously top up. Another way of checking it, if you have got a gas cooker with the boiler state in the fault code, just go up to your gas cooker, turn the burners on so you know the gas comes through. If the gas comes through, it is a fault on the boiler. If it doesn't come through, you know there's a fault on the gas, either no money on it, or it could even be a fault on the meter itself. Also to help us, if you do have a fault code comes up on the boiler, most boilers, once you reset them, they do come back on. But if you do reset it, please make a note of the fault code, time and the date when that fault was there. We know then whether it's happening in the morning when it's first starting up or whether it's been running throughout the daytime. On resetting the boiler, so simple. It's just press and hold a button. On the Remeyers, there's a letter R. Just press and hold that for three seconds and release it. On the new valence, it's got the actual round circle with a flame break. And with that, you just press and hold that. And it tells you then on the front screen, let it reset. And then you release the button and it all kicks back in. On the boilers, you have a fault code, and with the fault code, once you've done all the checks on the meters, if it's still coming up with F28 or E4, and then obviously you then need to contact Oxford City Council. We will then come round and replace what needs replacing.